Hello, welcome to Industrial Surplus. This is a video demonstration of our 1995 Toyota 4-axis CNC Horizontal Machining Center with a pallet changer. Uh, this machine was built new in 1995, uh, as I said, but it wasn't put into production until 1997. And uh, again, it is capable of full four-axis contouring milling. Uh, the size of the pallet is 17.7 by 17.7, .7, which is 450 millimeters. Uh, X-axis travel is 23.6 inches. Y-axis travel is 23.6. And Z-axis travel is 22, so you almost get a perfect cube out of this. Uh, B-axis rotary positioning Positioning is 360 thousandths. Uh, spindle nose to rotary table center distance is 4.92 to 26.97. Spindle nose to the top of the table, uh, maximum distance is 25.5 inches. 881 pound uh, pallet load capacity. It's equipped with uh, this. this uh, chip conveyor and coolant system. Also has coolant through the spindle. It's equipped with a uh, FANUC model 15MB CNC control. Uh, has a full coolant closure course with electronic doors uh, interlock. Motorized chip conveyor, as I said, automatic lube system, rigid tapping, and a 30 horsepower spindle motor. And the uh, spindle speeds are 12,000 RPM maximum, and a Cat 40 spindle nose. I will uh, stick the camera inside, try to give you an idea what it looks like. Uh, this machine was in a uh, high-end aerospace uh, facility here in Connecticut, and uh, it has been well-maintained lightly used. Uh, the number of hours on this are uh, incredible. There are about uh, 2,600 uh, cutting hours on here. I'll just do a quick walk around the machine and then we'll uh, uh, jog the machine. We don't, uh, we're not programmers so we don't really know how to program the machine unfortunately but uh, we could certainly uh, give you an idea how the machine sounds, how it works, do a tool change, pallet change. Uh, it's in great condition. I have a uh, full set of documents, so all the books are here. So we should be all set with that. And I'll do a quick walk around the back side. Here's the back of the uh, spindle showing, uh, well, I don't know how much you can see, but uh, this is the back side of the spindle. Linear ways, ball screw for the uh, x-axis, y-axis screw and uh, slides are up in here, if you can see them. Again, it's a, it's a very clean machine and uh, has not uh, had a lot of use. I'm going to show you inside the uh, tool changer, uh, the 40 position tool changer. And the reason I want to show you this is because we noticed uh, one of the pocket holders up here, number position one, is missing. And I want everybody to be aware that that's the case. So there isn't any discrepancy later on. That's all about. What's that? I noticed a zero zero there. Forty zero zero one. So, uh, well, maybe there is one missing. I don't know what. Uh, zero. It looks position. like there is one missing. That's what it looks like. So, uh, I'll just come around here. I want to show you the uh, hydraulic system. How uh, you know. Getting uh, back to the maintenance of this machine, uh, these people tagged everything, they have it marked, it's 
Uh, we haven't wiped this machine down at all. This is the condition we got it in. It's just uh, fantastic. All right, we'll uh, go ahead and uh, home the machine and then be able to uh, jog it around, do some spindle speeds. and. Uh, set there. Why don't we just jog some of the axis around or do whatever you you know, however you want to do it in sequence. Let's do a pallet change. Ready? Oh, let me close the door. getting familiar with this machine yeah, ourselves so uh, bear with us and we'll uh, get through this pretty quick pallet change it's nice all right and uh, call it a tool Calling a tool up first. Now we're going to do the M6. Okay. Now let's do. We're going to start the spindle. That's 2000. What? <laughs> that's 2000 RPM. Okay. I'm sure that's a. And uh, that's just so quiet, it's incredible. Seems really no different than 500 RPM. Can we, uh, uh, yeah, just jog it around and uh, go through some of the. Uh, sure, I'm gonna jogging it around and rapid. We're gonna bring the pallet into the two. That's the pallet rotator. That is so quiet, so smooth, you wouldn't believe it. Guards don't really make any noise. All right, uh, that's the machine. If you have any questions or would like to see this under power for yourself, feel free to give us a call. We'd be happy to show it to you. And uh, we look forward to working with you. Thank you.